Lisa Shabazian, I'm principal at John Moore School, and we, are, we have the physics lab here today from Fresno State, just to expose our kids to more science. Um, our curriculum, sometimes we get too involved with just math and, and ALA, and we wanted to make sure the kids get all kinds of um, science background and build so that they can have that background knowledge when they do read um, something scientific. And so we're really proud that Mr. Colbert, our teacher here, is able to do this for the kids. Um, he worked with this group when he was doing undergrad work, so we're really happy and excited to have them here. Step on him. There you go. Now I'm going to let you go. And you're going to make sure you look at the cameras. All right? You're good, Sean. We can hold for a little while. You want to do that? I'm fine. I thought so. She's pretty lightweight. Now, the board's probably heavier than her. Exactly. Now, why can we do that? Yeah, let's take a look. And this is the best thing about science. 
We get to make a prediction, like everyone has been doing, and then we get to test it. That is what science is about, and we want to be able to replicate our results every single time. Are we ready? Yeah. So what's happening? This is transferring its energy all the way through them. Now, if these balls weren't identical in mass, it would not work. So now I'm going to pull four. What's going to happen now? Four. Celsius. 
It's very, very full. He's going to count down when he does it, all right? So we're going to see what happens to the onion, because normally when you drop an onion, it just drops. It bounces, right? So let's see what I froze this in liquid nitrogen, so it's sealed, okay? Everyone take one step back. Everyone. I'm going to count down now. Three, two, one. Just hold it, it's very cold. You better not hold it on. Very cold. Don't push it in my face. Oh my god, it's cold! 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 Oh